I'm just curious, what made you put up the no soliciting sign? She's like, those window sales guys. With the old windows. And might put it up because of them. Or maybe, yeah, there's a bunch of reasons why they would. And then some of them just... Can I help you? Yes, it's nothing serious at all. Um, I did read your sign. I'm not trying to act like I'm illiterate, and I don't mean any disrespect at all. It's not my sign. I just rent here. So oh, okay. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, we're just out oh, with a local sure. mechanic. They look too hopeful here, but you never know, do you? This is true. For so long, some of them hate salespeople. And some of them are those the attack dogs? <laughs> <laughs> Remember, as far as anyone knows, we are a normal family. Now, if I'm around here by myself, I'll get lost. <clears throat> that's why you have a map with you. No, that's not going to help me. <clears throat> I've always coached, always taught, and that's been my life. And so anything else I have, I've, all my friends think I have no place in business, have no business sense, and so I tell them I'm going to, going to work. They have a hard time believing it. And what we got for you today is the greatest deal in the world. Looks like this is dark. I have no idea what I'm doing. And what we're doing for him is we're going out into the neighborhood, offering people a great deal, a great package, right. a great value for him. What he wants to do is get you into his shop so he can earn your trust and right. your service. So can I ask you, how much you pay for your, for your oil changes? I get it out of the Honda garage. Are they free? No. They still charge you for them? Yeah. You pay what? About 30 bucks, 20 bucks? I don't know. Don't know? It doesn't really matter. Well, it doesn't really matter? Well, what we got. I, they, I, it's part of a contract. I, I'm not interested in it. Oh, you're not interested in this? Mm -hmm. well, okay, because they're just. They're, what they want to do is get you into their shops so they can get your business. And so what they're doing is giving oil changes for 10 bucks a piece. What, what, what do you mean? I just don't want to participate. Oh. I see. Well, but you'd, you'd take it and use it if you didn't have to pay anything for it? No, but uh, I'm old enough that I would just as soon think about things before I sign up for anything. Oh, I, I get you. And so it's really a good deal. They want to get you into the shop, earn your trust, get your business locally owned. So that's what we're out here. Well, we'd love to come back, but here's our only problem. What we do to help companies like this is they send us out here into a neighborhood. Right. And so we're only out here for a day. And then we don't, right. we don't come back for... I don't know, I think the last time you are in this neighborhood was three years. Yeah, right. And so that, that would be the only problem. But okay. it is a great deal, don't you think? Well, yeah, a good but value? I, don't, I don't think I'm going to participate. Oh, is there something I could do to help you change your mind? Did, no. I, did I offend you in some I way? I doubt that very much. How you doing? Mm -hmm. Hmm? You guys go out to meet in Inville? Yeah. Let's try some businesses later? Yes. Yeah. Well, you'll get it. I hope so. I can't do this all the time and I don't make much money. Very attentive. He's good at what he does. I think his style will be a little bit different than mine mm -hmm. if I ever develop a style. Mm -hmm. Which uh, you will. Yeah. You already have your own style, yeah. believe it or not. Yeah, your style is already developed. Your it's... style is your personality. Well, good. So, well, my personality sucks. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> you have an awesome personality. <laughs> I like the the possibilities, the opportunity that this business affords, not only for the people, but financially so people can grow. Uh, they can do things that uh, they want to do in their life, I think, from several standpoints. My problem is I'm not a salesman, I'm a buyer. I mean, if somebody comes to my door, I buy it. I don't care who they are, I'll, I'll buy it.